Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to make a sheet metal tutorial in Autodesk Inventor software. So today we are going to make a hopper in Autodesk Inventor sheet metal. For that take a new, take a sheet metal part in millimeters. Take a 2D sketch, take the XY plane and take the rectangle command. Take the center point rectangle, two point center rectangle. Take the center point and give the dimensions 250 tab 100. So enter. 250 will be the width and 100 will be the height. So now exit sketch. Now take the face command and uh, it will automatically select the sketch and apply. Okay. Now take the, uh, now we are taking sheet metal thickness as 0.5 mm. It is the default thickness by the software. Now take the flange command select this inner edge give a dimension angle will be 90 degree and the distance will be 250 mm and apply similarly select this edge and it will also be 250 mm distance now select this edge and now if we take 250 mm as a dimension the sheet will close all the uh, the sheet will get closed and we will not be able to open the sheet again to give the flat pattern so for here we will take a dimension of 249 mm so it will make a gap of 0.5 mm and apply So now we are going to make the taper profile for that we will select the inner edges select this edge so it's uh, getting at an angle of 90 degree to give it a taper we will select the angle as 30 degree and the distance will be 200 similarly we have to select all the edges at once select this select this edge and select the last one also this edge ok and apply so it's been made now we have to give the bottom profile square profile for that select the outer edge the angle will remain 30 degree select this select all the edges at once and give it a dimension of 25 mm now apply ok now the profile is been made so we can assign the material normally SS304 is been applied so I'll assign stainless steel 304 grade as a material to the hopper you can see here radius has been shown in all three edges there will be a radius and there will be a gap on one edge so for that now we will create the flat pattern which you will provide for cutting the sheet so click on create flat pattern it will open the sheet and I will revolve it ok so this will be the 
flat pattern or, or the development size which you will provide for cutting the sheet by laser cutting so uh, go back to folded pad, uh, folded part so this is the hopper which have been commonly used in industries so that's all for today's video i hope you like the video please do like and subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you